Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Asian Programmer. So today we're going to learn about how, I, how we can create a power set in C++. Let me give you an introduction. What is a power set? So basically a power set is a subset of all the set. So we, let's say we have the set ABC over here. So the power set of ABC will be like empty. A, B, C, A, B, A, C. It means that all the combination which we can create with A, B, C, that will become the power set. So we, how we can get the total value of the power set? Let's say we have three values in, in our set A, B, C. So the value in power set will be 2 key power and the element present in, in that particular set, which is 3. So 2 key power 3 will give us and 2, 8 elements. So here there are 8 elements and the first will consider the empty set as well so and the, the remaining are seven elements so let's create this in our c++ code okay what we need to do we need to make a function void which named as power set in between we will just send an array and uh, integer array size okay we need to make an integer n in which we will save power okay it's just written over here in which we will just save power function to comma the size of an array okay right now it's giving error because we haven't include a library which is called math.h in which this this power function is present okay after this we will have to loop through it we have to create a loop integer i is equal to 0 i less than equal to n i plus plus for and we have to create another loop for integer j is equal to 0 j less than equal to size of an array and j plus plus okay here now what we need to do we have to make an if condition over here if I bitwise and operator 1 left shift J so these are the, are the true operator which is like bitwise operator you can learn on the Google if you search these operator you will find find out what these these op uh, bitwise operator do so first of all it uh, these operator just left shift the one bit it is used for the multiplication if you don't uh, use the multiplication static you can multiply this with with these left shift operators then there is like an AND operator with, which is just doing the work like an AND operator ok so I guess there is like not hard ok we get it now what we need to do we will just need to print C out array of J over here and after the loop we will just need to print C out handle so you can see it more properly let's go to the main function what we need to code in the main function over here we have to create an array and give random values to the array let's say 1 2 3 4 we are giving 4 values to the array we will get the int size equal size of array divided by size of array 0 well this size of will work when you are getting values from the user Okay, we will just need to send the powers values of array in the power set and size of okay. We'll just run it through. Let's see what will be the output. So we get the all the output except the empty set in the start. So we have to write the empty set in here hard coded. See out this because um, there is not like an empty set in this one so we have to write this way you just have to print the c out so we can get the value okay yeah so we get the empty set and the remaining 15 values which will be equal to the 16 let's give more values so we can see how the output will change i'm just giving one more value 5 now there's like a 32 values in here so these array is in the sorted order what if the array is not in the sorted order then what will be happen there's nothing gonna be happen because this function is 
not gonna concern if the array is sorted or unsorted because in the end they it will just give you the total uh, combination which can be uh, make with these values in a particular set that's how you can create a power set okay i, have, I hope you guys like this video do subscribe and like my channel if you have any query with regarding this program or, uh, or with the, any other program which i have created on my youtube channel do let me know in the comments i will try to rectify your problems and also i will ensure share your code with me as well if you have better code if you think my code is like a bit inefficient but this one is like the most efficient i have known because this complexity is like uh, two uh, two power n that's it that's the minimum time complexity which you require to make a power set over here so if you think you have the code as well you also want to share your code with me you can send it to me in the uh, in the comment box or you can send it to me on the email i will share my email and i'm also gonna share this code uh, link in the comment box so you can uh, in the description sorry in the description so you can get the code as well if you want it thank you bye bye